Hey folks, a very sad event happened on the homestead uh, yesterday. Uh, I'm, I'm heartbroken. Uh, we lost our baby turkey. Stay tuned and I'll share with you guys the story. We'll be right back. Welcome back to Pine Meadows Hobby Farm. I'm your host, Jerry Hansen. I am not a happy farmer. I am disgusted. I was sitting on my porch swing uh, the other day, uh, yesterday, and just enjoying the evening. And I saw a gray squirrel up here and stuff. Didn't think about it. And I just got through Ted taking care of the baby turkey because they, uh, they managed to find a way out. I found out how they got out and I fixed the uh, breach in the fence but when I came out the next morning there was no baby turkeys I assumed it was the rat or that fuzzy tailed rat the squirrel I don't know I don't know if squirrels even go out for meat but I lost all my chicks in the chicken yard a uh, couple weeks ago I don't know what got them I assume it was ravens and crows but ravens and crows cannot get into my turkey house because the aviary is completely enclosed. So I have a lot of assumptions and all of them are probably incorrect. And the creature that may have gotten them could have been an ermine, or ermine, don't know how to pronounce it, uh, or a ferret. We do have them in this area. Uh, and it could have been the squirrel. I, I know the squirrels go after the eggs. I've caught them. We've got the possum that goes after eggs and chicks, but I, I think that the, the uh, possum couldn't squeeze through and get in there. Something else got in and got to my chicks. I think it squeezed in under the door. Ah, so I've got to fix that. Um, got to really fortify it. Anyway, I lost my my two baby turkeys we were successful this year at getting turkeys and alas ended up in failure because of predators i hate predators i hate i hate i hate them i'm going to set out the trail cam around the turkey house to see what's lurking around at night and see what's uh what i can do about it uh, i set out some live traps uh, in hopes of catching it i baited them with chicken eggs in hopes that it'll attract them. They were out last night, didn't catch anything but a little gray squirrel. And I'm doing another show on um, gray squirrels. Yeah, maybe it, this was the creature that got the, uh, yeah, got the baby chicks and it went for the baby turkeys. Anyway, from now on, I'm raising my babies in cages. Have to. With the predators we have, I have to, I have no choice. Well, that's the saga of farming out in the wilderness of southwestern Oregon. Uh, stay tuned. I'll show you, I'll let you guys know on updates from time to time. Uh, please click this channel and also I'll leave some links down below in the description of two other channels that I am uh, producing right now. I have a channel on my art called Jerry Hansen Studios. I have art right now hanging in the gallery in the rogue gallery and then also I have another channel I'm filming at my neighbor's house we have five episodes up already and we load a new episode every Monday and Thursday there's a new episode coming up a uh, day after tomorrow uh, so stay tuned for that that is Southern Oregon Safari where Buffalo roam there's links down below so click on those channels and be sure you subscribe especially on um, where Buffalo roam we need to build up so many subscribers and have so many hours watched in order for the channel to be monetized and the monetization the revenue from that goes towards the feeding the animals because these are animals that they've adopted they've rescued uh, they're retired animals and then they're just taking care of them there's elephants there's a rhino there's a herd of bison there's some black uh, 
buck, uh, yeah, black buck antelope. There's uh, East African, or crowned East African cranes, ostriches. There's serval cats. There's caracal cats. There's two types of giant tortoises. Uh, there's these gypsy horses. Um, there's all kinds of animals over there, and we're going to be featuring different um, different animals on each show, and also the infrastructure over there on the ranch. Anyway, stay tuned for those. Click on those uh, links down below. Be safe. Always be kind. We'll see you guys in my next adventure. Hopefully, it'll be happier. Bye-bye now.